In today's video, I'll talk about design fix suggestions that you get while reviewing LVS results in RVE. When a designer is reviewing LVS results, certain design errors are difficult to trace. Design fix suggestions, once enabled in the rule file, are available in Caliber RVE and provide easy to understand tips for fixing such types of errors. Let's see how. Here are results from my LVS run. Extraction errors may cause LVS comparison errors. Therefore, before reviewing the suggestions, we need to review the extraction results tab to make sure there are no connectivity and device extraction errors or warnings. Now, let's check the comparison results. Choose one of the fixed types and expand the tree view until you get to the error. My LVS result lists two fixed suggestions and four discrepancies as shown. Let's say, I want to fix the pin swap error. When you select the error to be fixed, you get fix suggestion in the detailed result listing. The last line has a suggestion for fixing the problem. A visualize fix option is available for you to see the error affected source and layout nets in separate windows for a specific fix. RV opens three schematic windows as shown, the middle one indicating the layout instance with highlighted connectivity of the source schematic. The fix visualization may not be available for all LVS errors. After the visualization, we need to actually make the fix in the layout. You can click and highlight the affected design elements in your layout viewer. Mentioned in the suggested fix, as you can see, pins 3 and 5 in my layout need to be swapped. By just clicking on them, I get pin 5 highlighted in purple and pin 3 highlighted in light green in the layout. I fix the errors by simply extending the polygon edge and moving metal 1 connection from pin 5 to pin 3. And from pin 3 to pin 5. Calibre RVE does not maintain a correspondence between fixed suggestions and discrepancies, so we need to rerun LVS to make sure that our fix worked as expected. After making this fix and rerunning LVS, you can see the discrepancy count is now reduced, so the suggested fix was successful. Thanks for watching the video.